What's up? What's happening? What's popping? What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another great episode of Simone with the Spizzords. I'm Simone bringing you guys daily sports talk. So if you're new here, if you're older and you haven't already subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you stop what you're doing. Leave a comment, subscribe, keep rocking with me. Check out the mini links down below. Buy me a copy to help fuel this channel. Shout out the official Simone with the Spizzords merch collection. Get you the classic tee, the wavy tee, or the fly or die crew neck. And lastly, make sure you guys turn your notification bells on because you already know the videos are coming like boom, 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 boom. And you don't want to miss a single video or live stream, especially when we get some news like this. So guys, we just signed Zach Pascal, former Indianapolis Colt wide receiver to the Philadelphia Eagles. So we finally signed a wide receiver. This is somebody who Nick Sirianni has a lot of experience with. And Nick Sirianni has seemingly been in love with Zach for a very long time. So we signed Zach. Zach is now on the roster. Zach spent four years with the Indianapolis Colts. He's only played with the Colts and he had 15 touchdowns um, over the four seasons. He's pretty much appeared in almost every game um, each season, uh, but he's only started a few games. So Zach is somebody who's pretty much a slot machine. Um, he's basically a guy who can definitely come in and man the slot for the Philadelphia Eagles. So I like this move just because it's somebody that Nick Sirianni is familiar with. And, you know, you always want players that have some familiarity with the coaches. Um, good move. Like I said, we, he definitely a guy who can come in and man the slot. And he's kind of a guy that's kind of been under the radar, kind of flew under the radar a little bit. Um, playing in a Colts offense that's always continuously had um, different stars leading on offense. So Zach is somebody, like I said, who come in, man, the slot. But you guys know I still um, want to turn some attention to the wide receiver position in the draft. Um, after getting Zach, it kind of makes me believe, obviously, Jarvis Landry is off the board because Jarvis Landry is somebody who would have came in and <laughs> man the slot. But now we have Zach. I highly doubt We'll be getting Jarvis Landry. Um, probably doubt. I mean, I would still love a DK Metcalf, but I highly doubt we're going to make any other free agency move at wide receiver. So I definitely want us to still focus on getting a wide receiver out of this draft. Now, it definitely doesn't necessarily have to be with our first round pick, um, but I definitely would want to still get a big body X receiver out of this draft. We definitely did need, you know, a slot specialist and someone who could man the slot like Zach would be able to. But I still want a big body traditional X wide out on this roster before the season starts um, in September. But y'all, it's just good to see the Eagles on the headlines. You know, all these other teams been still in the headlines. But it's good to see my birds back on the headlines. So how we still in the office, how we still making moves. Let's see what else he might do. But guys, make sure you like this one with me. Leave a comment, subscribe. Of course, let me know your thoughts. Um, yeah, and until I talk to you guys next time. Bye.